What's up you guys, it's Steve here, and in this video I'm gonna be sharing with you seven stimulus checks and payments that you can get this month that are gonna be worth up to $10,915 collectively, and some of these are gonna be going out automatically, and this is your stimulus check update. Now you guys, I'm gonna be diving into this article, getting you caught up on all of these different funds and provisions that are gonna be available to many people, and also, if you missed my last video, check out this one right here to find out about stimulus checks going out in California Indiana and also Atlantic City New Jersey and also if you missed this one right here you're gonna want to check it out if you are a low-income earner you can get the EITC which they have expanded eligibility for a lot of young people even older people over the age of 65 which was the cutoff before and also they've expanded the income limit so a lot more people are gonna be eligible for up to six thousand seven hundred and twenty eight dollars with the EITC tax credit you must claim on your taxes. So be sure to check out those videos right after this one if you missed it. But you guys, let's go ahead and dive into this article, get you caught up on seven different ways that could earn you over $10,000. Now also wanted to say thank you for all the support on the second channel, Steve Ram Finance. And if you're interested in learning about growing wealth and personal finance through maybe business, real estate, stocks, I'm uploading content on there to help out people that are maybe starting over with everything going on right now. I hope that channel is going to be a blessing to you. If you're interested, I'll pin a comment down below. You can click the link, go subscribe, turn on notifications, and keep an eye out for more content on that channel. But right now, let's get you caught up on seven different ways to get this stimulus, and let's start off by smashing the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Helps me out a ton, I appreciate it. If you appreciate the content, it helps me out a lot. Thank you so much. Also, leave your comments, share this out, and if this is your first time here and you'd like to stay up to date, totally free, hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and you can stay up to date. And if you got any specific questions that you want me to answer directly, I'm easy to get a hold of. All you gotta do is hop onto Instagram, shoot me a DM at steveram3. But with that being said, you guys, let's go ahead and dive right in. All right, so link in the description below to this article that came out this month, and this is all gonna be applicable for the month of February 2022. And this says there's seven stimulus checks and payments that you can get this month worth up to $10,915. Now the article says millions of Americans can claim a range of payments this month with some worth thousands of dollars. Now some of these are gonna be stimulus checks, while others range from tax credits to universal basic income. And there are tons of UBI programs coming out in various cities. I've been keeping you up to date on those, so make sure to subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on new UBI programs as applications are being accepted in many cities right now. Now the article says, but regardless, many Americans are gonna be eligible to get some form of cash. Now below we list various payments that you might be able to claim or receive automatically in the month of February. Now first up is a federal stimulus check, and federal means the entire nation, so anybody is eligible, and they're talking about $1,400, likely that third stimulus check. And it says, while most have gotten their third round of stimulus checks worth up to $1,400, there are some still who are owed a payment. Now, this may include the following families, according to a recent post from the IRS, and that is parents who recently had a baby in 2021. So if you just had a baby, congratulations, but baby also was supposed to get a stimulus check, and you're gonna need to claim that on your taxes. Also, families who added a dependent on their 2021 tax returns, individuals and couples who earned more than $80,000 and $160,000 respectively in 2020, but less than that amount in 2021. So maybe you weren't eligible before, but last year you are, and the IRS doesn't have that updated information and you didn't get a check, well, you are due $1,400 stimulus checks. And it says to get the payments, you must claim the recovery rebate credit on your tax return. And I cover all the steps in detail in a previous video. If you missed it, be sure to check it out right after this one as you wanna make sure you get all the money that's available to you right now through all of these stimulus programs. Now, as of December, the IRS had issued more than 175 million third round stimulus checks, but there are still many people out there that haven't gotten it. So, like I said, if you need to claim it, be sure to check out that video right after this one. Now, next up is the child tax credit, worth up to $3,600. Now, you probably got that in the, the second half of 2021. You were getting those monthly payments for your children, but you only received half of it. Now, they're talking about the other half that is gonna be on the way, and it says another key payment that you can claim on your tax return is gonna be the $3,600 child tax 
credit, which was temporarily expanded under the American Rescue Plan. Now, as a result, tens of millions of eligible families received up to $300 per child in monthly payments from July to December, giving them as much as $1,800. Now, once Americans file their returns, they will be able to claim their remaining half of the child tax credit payments. If you were eligible but did not receive a payment because you failed to sign up in time using the non-filer tool, you can claim the full $3,600. So if you were supposed to get child tax credits and you didn't, you can claim the whole thing when you file your taxes. And you can also claim up to $3,600 this tax season if you decided to opt out of the monthly advance payments. And I know a lot of people did that because they like to see a big return when they file, so they opted out of the payments. Now they receive them when filing their taxes. Now to qualify for the full payments, couples need to make less than $150,000, and single parents who filed as heads of house need to make under $112,000 500. Now, next up is California stimulus checks. And as you know, they had those Golden State checks, and I did an update for you as we're hearing. There might be another one coming out due to the surplus in the state. Like I said, check that one out after this video if you missed it. But California has launched two stimulus check programs, which are known as the Golden State Stimulus 1 and Golden State Stimulus 2. Now, just to clarify, you should not be receiving two checks there. Just one went out to a certain group of people, and then a second phase went out to other people who didn't get the first one. Now, under the first program, eligible residents got either $600 or $1,200, while the latter got paid $1,100. Now, to be eligible for either check, Californians must have made less than $75,000 per year and generally have filed 2020 taxes before October 15th of 2021. And I've been letting everybody know this, there is a lot of stimulus provisions going out right now, and in order for you to make sure that you're getting what is due to you, you're gonna wanna file your taxes. Even if you normally don't, you're gonna wanna make sure that you do that so the IRS has your updated information and you can make sure that you get what you're supposed to receive from these stimulus programs. Now, if you were eligible for both stimulus programs and applied for an individual tax identification number or a ITIN by October 15th, you have until February 15th of 2022 to file your tax return and still get that cash. California's Public Affairs Office told The Sun earlier in January that up to 100,000 residents would get automatic stimulus checks in the next month. So that is in the state of California. Now, next up, we have New Jersey payments of $500, and I actually reported this to you yesterday as well. Property owners in Atlantic City, New Jersey, who went through financial hardship through the pandemic, might be able to get $500 payments soon. And in two to three weeks, eligible property owners will get forms where they will have to prove that they have suffered financial hardship. Now, you should be receiving that right now if you haven't gotten it already. Next week is likely gonna be the last week that you can expect to see that in the mail. Once the affected property owners review them, they then need to send them back to the city for review. While it's unclear how many will qualify, more than 37% of Atlantic City's roughly 38,000 residents are said to be living below the poverty line. Next up is UBI, or Universal Basic Income, which I cover in depth here on the channel, letting you know what is available to you. Now, since the beginning of the pandemic, various cities and states have launched their own UBI programs, which are set with reoccurring payments rather than one-off stimulus checks. So these are monthly payments that you receive over and over. In some cases, one year, two years, even three years. Now, typically, UBI programs aim to help low-income Americans by providing them with an extra stream of funds each month. Now, if you happen to live in Atlanta, Georgia, you can apply for $500 monthly payments for a year right now. Now, to be eligible, you must be at least 18 years old and have an income below 200% of the federal poverty line. Also, you'll need to act quickly because the deadline to apply is Tuesday, February the 2nd. So this one actually just passed for Georgia. Washington, D.C. recently announced a $1.5 million UBI program for new parents in the area, which is the sixth payment on the list. Now, the Strong Family Strong Future D.C. program will provide $900 per month, and I shared that one with you just recently as well, for one year for 132 new and expectant mothers in wards 5, 7, and 8. Now, when it comes to qualifications, mothers living in one of three wards must make less than 250% of the federal poverty levels. Now, the programs will launch this month and will be implemented by nonprofit organizations Martha's Table and $2,815 for tax returns. And it says, and lastly, if you've been overpaid in taxes in 2021, you'll get a refund. And in the week ending December 3rd, Americans received on average 
$2,815 in tax refunds, an 11% increase from the previous year according to the IRS. Now, most Americans should have received their W-2 forms, which contains key information about taxes and incomes with your employer. Now, also, I did a video going into detail for you on forms and everything that you need to know about filing your taxes this year, 2022 for 2021, as a lot of laws have changed, I cover it in detail for you. Stimulus checks, unemployment, what's happening with the child tax credits. Be sure to check that one out right after this one if you haven't filed yet and you've got some questions about how to go through that process. And that is those forms that they're sending out that I cover in that video. But you guys, that is the latest on seven different ways that you can get up to $10,000 coming this month. And you guys, as more information rolls out, I'll be sure to keep you up to date. I'm keeping you up to date on what's happening with the Build Back Better stimulus negotiations, what's happening with President Joe Biden and uh, Congress with more phases of stimulus that they're talking about. And I will keep you up to date on all this stuff so you know what's going on and you know what's available to you. And as always, thank you so much for joining me. If you made it this far and you haven't already, don't forget, take a quick second to smash that like button. Helps me out with the YouTube algorithm a ton. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Also, leave your comments, share this out. If this is your first time here, totally free to stay up to date. Just hit the subscribe button, turn on that notification bell. You can come join the Ram fam. And if you got any specific questions for me, shoot them to me in the DM on Instagram at steveram3 and consider joining that second channel, Steve Ram Finance, to learn about growing wealth and personal finance. But with that being said, you guys, I hope that this helps you out and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care. God bless. This is Steve.